Surugada is the dance of the spirit. A child that wants to know the cause of his parents' death must be ready to dance in the tune of a Surugada, which is a Gundemo in my dialect. My brother, which you don't know, you don't know. Because he's senior you. That's not your grandmama, not your grandpapa. That's not the matter of you. Good day, viewers, distinguished ladies and gentlemen. Yesterday, IPOB, the indigenous people of Biafra, were in Api Court yesterday to appeal and determine you know, if Nigeria will continue to tag IPOB, a terrorist organization, or they will drop that tag, terrorist organization. Because we know that there are so many organizations in this country that are carrying arms, doing all sorts of hideous crimes, killing people on daily basis, committing massacre upon massacre. Those people have not been tagged terrorist group, and besides, they are being aided by Nigerian government. But on the since 2017, the IPUB has been tagged a terrorist group by Nigeria. So as a matter of that, they went to for hearing in the Api Court of yesterday, so that that tag terrorist group against the people of indigenous people of Biafra should be cancelled. Now, I know most of you must have been hearing or uh, wanting to hear the feedback from me as I promised us that I'm going to give us feedback of the outcome. But it's quite unfortunately, my schedule was very tight yesterday. So that is why I could not come up to give us the outcome of the schedule. But this very moment, I have come to ignite us or rather to enlighten us more about what happened on that very day. But before I dive straight into this article that uh, was, you know, written, as a feedback by one of the legal team, the chief counsel of uh, uh, Namdekano's legal team, the person of Barista Aloy Ejimako, I uh, would like us to know that uh, the uh, government, a federal court of appeal, has you know taken the next hearing to 90 days time. That is when they will nullify you know the attack or rather the hashtag terrorist against that delivered against the people of indigenous Biafra. So, ladies and gentlemen. Let me dive straight into the article as written and in a feedback by the chief counsel of the legal team of Finlander, Colonel Barrister Aloy Ejimako. These were his reports. I read Designation of IPOB as terrorist appeal, as terrorists, appeal calls to deliver judgment in 90 days. Ejimako quoted. Aloy Ejimako, lead counsel of Finlander, Colonel. Leader of the Indigenous People of Biafra (IPOB) has said the appeal court will deliver judgment in the reversal of the group's designation as a terrorist organization within the next 90 days. IPOB was designated a terrorist organization six years ago by the administration of ex-president Muhammad Buhari on September 20, 2017, like they have said to us earlier. Buhari's administration proscribed IPOB as a terrorist organization accusing it of committing, instigating, and facilitating several acts of terrorism in the Southeast. But on Thursday, the Court of Appeals sitting in Abuja resolved its judgment on an appeal on an appeal the IPOB filed to challenge its prescription as a terrorist organization by the federal government. A three-man panel of the court led by Justice Hammer Baka adjoined the matter for judgment. After federal government and IPOB through their respective lawyers, adopted their final briefs of arguments. IPOB has prayed the appellate courts to set aside in its entirety the ruling slash final decision of the late former Chief Judge of the Federal High Court Justice Abdul Abdu Kafarati, which on September 15, 2017, applauded its activities in Nigeria. Reacting, A.G. Mako posted on his ex handle Today, the six-year quest to reverse the designation of hashtag IPOB as a terror group ended at the Court of Appeal, where the appeal was finally heard on the merits, despite a view venuvre to force another adjournment. Judgment will be expected within the next 90 days, as mandated by law. Now, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, thank you all very much for that. That is all you need to know in updates of uh, the outcome of uh, the Court of Appeal yesterday that was held in respect of the uh, uh, designation of the terrorist attack that was labeled against Biafra, the IPOB, the Chinese people of Biafra, by one late Justice Abdul, Abdul Kafarati, on the 15th of 2017, under the regime of ex-president Mohamed Bouwari. So, according to our law, Yejimako, the Court of Appeal concluded that the case will be judged 
or uh, judgment will be passed in the next 90 days or within the next 90 days which means it could be below 90 days or it could be 90 days approximately but in that space of now to 90 days the judgment will be unveiled and the good thing is that the judgment as it is unveiled it is obvious that they are dropping the terrorist hashtag that they have labeled on IPOB. now ladies and gentlemen in this regard do you people think that Nigerian governments they have the law jurisdiction anywhere in around the constitution of Nigeria to tag an organization like IPOB a terrorist organization? Do you think, do you think so? For me, I don't think they have the jurisdiction in anywhere in the constitution to tag them terrorist organization. As we all know and the world know that IPOB organization is a non-violence organization. They are organization that does not carry weapon. They don't carry anything related to weapon. This is an organization that has been registered in over 80 countries in the world. Powerful countries, I mean. And those powerful countries have not tagged the terrorist group. Is it Nigeria that will tag the terrorist group? If not, that they are looking for what is not looking for them. Anyway, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, that is all, by the way. So I want you all to take good care of yourself and thank you for watching this video to this very moment. If you like this video, which I trust you do to have watched it to this very moment, subscribe to this channel, hit the notification button so that you can get updates of every of my uploads and whenever I am streaming live. I remain Onye Chuku Mese, and this is my channel, Bendon TV. I love you all and I know you all love me too. Surugade is the dance of the spirit. A good more. A child that wants to know the cause of his parents' death must be ready to dance to the tune of it. So look at that, which is a good more in my dialect. My brother, which you don't know, you don't know. Because he's senior you. That's not your grandmama, not your grandpapa. That's not the matter of you. One love. <laughs>